Ducky weather, awesome, awesome, awesome. East, southeast wind. Two in front. Get ready, get ready. Shoot them. What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Boy, howdy, we were, we were fighting shooting right there, weren't we? Uh, yeah, that'd be my fault. Well, <laughs> poop happens with dead batteries or ruined batteries that are just done. Uh, but we got a duck hunt today. I'm gonna try to shoot some geese too. Oh man, I'm sweating. It's like 60 degrees, misty. <sighs> Low pressure, ducky weather, awesome, awesome, awesome. East, southeast wind. Two in front. <laughs> get ready, get ready. Shoot them. Nice, nice. crunch. Woo! Woo! Right there. Did you see that? Dude, that's sick. Good shoot. Hey, 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 fetch it up. Let's go, let's go. Dude. Good. Awesome. Come on. Reload, boys. Who clicked? Good. Good. I, I clicked. clicked. I clicked. I heard it go. <laughs> what is it? Pintail. What? Oh my god, yeah. there's a big group out front. Yep, big group out front. Fetch it up. Fetch it up. That was awesome. There's a, we have another group huh? out front, but they didn't like it. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Kill him! Oh, nice. I shot that one! I just, okay. I just shot that one! <laughs> Alright. Uh, just got a hand mallard. Uh, what do we in? One, two, three, four in. Uh, that, that big group, they didn't decoy very well. Were they in our face? Yes, but kind of had our butt to us, kind of going away. It's better just to watch the show and, and instead of trying to shoot them up the rear, you know. So. Uh, going really well. This is uh, this is not a duck feed. This is just a traffic duck duck hunt. So um, they're actually feeding in the uh, in the wheat all around us. Uh, but this is thick corn, good cover, uh, cloudy day, corn uh, gilly blankets. Um, instead of we opted for the gilly blankets instead of laying in white because there's no uh, there's no sun and you need sun in white to hide you so it's bright. So. When it's not sunny, they see through it, and you got to cover up with gillies. So, uh, going really well. This is fun. Hopefully, the geese see us and come over here and play too. They're making noise over there. Hold on, vlog. I'll turn it to you now. I'm not. You have to. They're making them, noise tell, over no, there. No, no. Tell them about the podcast. Oh, the podcast. Yeah, we're hitting it hard now. 
it uh, it kind of slowed down in the summer it always does but where you got new people in all the time and uh, probably not going out tonight yeah it's is your guys last night tonight uh, yeah, last yeah. Night tonight, yeah so it's definitely not kid friendly <laughs> yeah it's for adults I'm just gonna tell you now <laughs> we're very honest a little vulgar and we have a lot of fun uh, well, the podcast is always linked down below in the description, always at the top. So with sandhillflyways.com, uh, we are uh, scheduling scheduling people, putting you on a list to book next season. If you want to book next season, this season we have some availability. Um, I can put you on a callback list in case someone drops out. But fill out the form at sandhillflyways.com, and I'll get a hold of you about next season for sure. On the right, is this pintails. Yeah. Don't shoot if you shot a pintail. You ready on the right? Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Okay, one, spread. Okay, that's it. Did you get one? Yeah, I did. Good, here. Good boy, here. Good, good, good. Heel, heel. No, heel, over here, over here. Man. Okay, Here we go. Diddy got him uh, a penny. Shoot the two. Hurry, 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 hurry. Nice, nice one down. Fred. Had to, we had to get something out of it, you know? It was kind of, oh, yeah. they, they got out of there fast, but we had to get something out of it finally. Out front, guys. Yep. Shoot the two. Hurry, 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 hurry. Nice, nice one down. Good boy, let's go, let's go. All right. Mallard down, greenhead. Move the mojos, right? This is where the birds are wanting to decoy. So we're gonna see if it helps. Small spread, uh, not a lot of guys. I'll go over the spread here in a little bit. Gilly blankets, that's the situation. Good, good. Who shot him? You Not did? Me. Okay. Heel away, Fred. Good boy. Lay down. Come on, y'all. Come on. <laughs> Shoot him right there. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice. Good. Fred. Yeah. Here, 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 here. Back. That's a big grain there. That's that shot right there. They're, they're not going to get any lower than that. I got to call it there. And they got to, you guys just got to get up as fast as you can and go on them. All right, all right. Let's see that fatty. Oh, yeah. They go double curl on them. Look at them, dude. Look how thick his neck is. Hold his beak up. Look at that. Just take right yeah, that's a stud muffin right there. That is a nice, nice white one. ring around his neck. Oh yeah, dude, he is pretty a bird, isn't he? Yeah, that's, that's a nice bird, man. So this is what you get, you know. Birds stay beautiful in a dry field because they're not landing in the water. They're not oh, getting yeah. muddy, right? So mm -hmm. when they're stud muffins, this is the best time to mount these things because they're not nasty. Yeah, this one might be going on the wall. I was gonna say you can gift tag it to me because I'll definitely, I would definitely <laughs> put it in the watch. Oh yeah, I need some more mallards in there for sure. But no, that's a that is a stud muffin for sure. Pretty bird. Where are you gonna take it? Take her home to him? Home to Thomasville, Georgia. Thomasville, oh, Georgia. Yeah. Way down south. You don't get mallards like that down oh, no. there. I'm gonna have to go home and shoot the ring next. <laughs> so that's gonna that's gonna suck compared to this, but still fun though. Yeah. But pretty bird. Yeah, man. Good shooting. Thank you, thank you. I think you're right. They're not eating. Yeah. They're not wanting to sit down and eat like the geese. They're just wanting to fly around. It's like when I was out here yesterday, I drove by at seven, they were flying, and then I drove by at nine, 9.30 and they were still flying. Mm -hmm. That's because they never land. Yeah, <laughs> they never land. Ready? 
Shoot him. No frill. Let's go. Fetch it up. I don't know why. If I'm not holding, I, if I'm sitting on a bucket running Fred, he will never break. If I'm laying down in a white spread, he will break. I don't understand it. Heel. So I had to catch him. I didn't let him break. That's why I dropped the camera. Heel. You're going to learn today, dude. Heel. Drop. That's a little lesser. He loved it. Get ready on the right. They're coming really low. Oh my God, they're gonna shortstop us. All right, shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Oh. Get, get ready, there's one in there still. Shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Yeah, Oh boy, I think those were wood ducks in the field. I'm not gonna lie. Come on, Freddy, show me up. Come on, show me what it is. Oh yeah. Drop, that's a wood duck. Wood ducks in the field, back. Wood ducks in the field. Fred, Fred, Fred here, Fred here, Fred here, here, dead bird, dead bird, dead bird. He got it. Good boy. That was awesome. Good. Well, that's a stud muffin. Good. Drop, drop. Look at that. A pair of woodies in the field. That's cool. What time is it? What time is it? Good. Cool. Right. That's awesome. What? Brent shot it and heard it. I finished it. <laughs> Which one? The last one? It was the, yeah, yeah, the last, the last one, one that flew one. up. Uh, that was the, definitely the hen. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> but you can have the... No, you shot them both, didn't you? No, I didn't. <laughs> I did. Oh, you shot, shot the first one? Oh, my bad, my bad. No, you good, you good. Look, Look at that, that stud muffin. Yeah, that stud. is a beautiful bird. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. That's a nice one, dude. Look how wow. beautiful. When you when you don't ever get to shoot a wood duck in the field and it land and not get oh, muddy yeah. and wet, right? I know. So That's you hardly a, ever get to see him like that. That is a pretty bird right there. Yeah. Look at his head. All those colors and his beak, the Look yellow. Look red around his eyes. I know. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, you got your left, sir. That was a good shot. Oh, we were uh, we were debating we were debating on picking up and uh, thank goodness we didn't because we got we shot four more birds a lesser another stud mallard that you got and then the two wood ducks and the guy that's been missing all day hit something <laughs> the guy that's been missing all day hit something. he hit it but didn't kill it <laughs> of course something happened there's always these two trash talk more than me and Preston, probably all of us put together to be oh, quite yeah. honest with you. Oh yeah. You Southern boys, you, I mean, you really do give it to each yeah. other pretty, pretty We don't hard. go soft. No, there's yeah, no- we go soft. all, but there is- We go, we go all out. All out we all the time. No holding back, just raw and- Mean. Mean. But you really don't mean it. No, I do. Yeah, <laughs> you're, <laughs> you're brutal. Got you back on the phone for the closing of the video. Last time I used the phone, it looked really weird. I don't know if like my editing system messes with it and like messes up the color saturation or what, but it's a brand new iPhone. This thing should work awesome. Are the colors weird on the iPhone? Drop a comment down below and let me know, please. Ah, what a hunt, what a hunt. Uh, we only had what, there was one, two, three, four, five clients in the field, uh, but only four were shooting. So, not bad. They shot well uh, that day. Could have shot a little better. I know you boys are watching this video and you know what I'm saying. So all you other guys out there, don't think I'm talking trash to my clients. Uh, my clients are the best clients in the world. My YouTube clients, again, are the best, I promise you, clients friends new friends that i get to meet from here from you all you i get to meet you when you come here when you come back here and you stay in the lodge it's so rewarding i love it so much you i, I say it all the time how much i love it but it's probably hard to say it right so a lot of you understand right like but moving on um that that hunt was what uh four days ago something like that since then we have gotten extremely cold 
uh, probably all of you have as well. I'm gonna stand inside right here because I am freezing. Uh, it's in the 20s and um, the hunting has gotten unbelievable. The next video that goes up is a lesser band video on Big Water. You do not want to miss it. It was amazing. Uh, coolest hunt yet of the season. Uh, and this lesser was one of the oldest banded lessers that I have ever... I didn't shoot it. I called the shot and, and Fred retrieved it, right? From the water. Big, big water. You got you can't miss the next video. Uh, one of the oldest birds. I'm not going to tell you where, where it was from. Basically the Arctic Circle. <laughs> so very far away and extremely old he's probably came down here so many times you know over let's over 14 years put it that way so he is much older than 14 but you guys got to watch the video to find out is amazing so um like i said at the beginning the podcast is fired up we are having a ton of fun over there no i do not recommend um children to go over there kids under 18 preferably not um, so adults over 18, please. Um, it's on Patreon, so there's not really an age restriction button, but you have to pay to play and it's very cheap. It's extremely cheap, but it's extremely active and you get to see the real Bobby over there. Not saying that I'm not real here, but I can't use the language that I do normally, you know, normally around all the boys. It's, it's basically the best, best way to show behind the scenes here. Everything we talk about, everything we're going through, uh, the ups and the downs, the highs, the lows, okay? So if you haven't checked out my, my, my podcast, please go check it out. You will laugh your yin-yang off. It's 50% serious and 50% shenanigans with a lot of laughing and giving each other BS. Just some of the stuff that we bring up is either, it's so off the wall sometimes, but it's so hilarious. You guys got to check it out. It's always linked down at the top of the description. So is sandhillflyways.com where you can book for next year. Um, and I'll also put the, uh, the the podcast link at the top of the comment section. I'll pin it there. So I'd greatly appreciate it if you guys uh, went and checked it out because we're putting a lot of effort into it. We got some special guests coming in. Uh, this next three days, Turtle Box. If you don't know what Turtle Box is, Google it. They're coming. Um, and High and Dry, the utility duck pool that I've been showing y'all, they're coming. So we're about to have some banger podcasts with them as well and hunting. So if you haven't checked it out, do it. You will not be disappointed. Uh, at least two to three a week, minimum two. And they're good. And they're usually over an hour long. So we cover our bases on there. So. Thank you all for being here. Guys, I want to remind you all, um, hunting safety really quickly, just to refresh everybody, even myself, talking about it and, and reminding you all and myself. Guys, big water, big water, big water. If you're in a John boat, don't overload it. If you're in a boat at all, don't overload it. If there's thick ice and you think that there's a good chance that you could capsize, do not go. Say no, my life is worth more than this duck. My life is worth more than this duck hunt. Please, no matter where you're at, deep water, you know, if it's deeper than, than waist or, or head deep and you're on a boat, please, 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 I'm begging you guys, please wear a life jacket. Please. I'm, I mean this. Please wear a life jacket every time you go out on the boat, okay? Use your brains. Use common sense. Please be safe. Spread the good word about it because uh, hunting-related accidents... Um, they're not gun related. Uh, most of them are drownings and it's, it's very unfortunate. We can, we can prevent that. So do your due diligence, stay safe. The, the life vest should be the first thing you put on before you get in the boat. It should be the first piece of equipment that you load in the truck, okay? Before the boat. Thank you guys. Stay safe, spread the good word, get out there, go hunt and make memories. But until next time. Your criticism, pessimism I've been keeping it on the DL Got a girl that keeps it real